Hey guys, how are you? Welcome back. My name is Christy Marie and thank you for joining me. Today, I want to talk to you guys about something that I think we can all relate to and that is our soul and um, why sometimes we feel, I want to say, not empty, but we feel off um, and that we feel like, you know, we're in a haze and, you know, we feel lost at times um, and we just feel like why we feel depressed sometimes and, you know, why we feel sad. Um, for the past, I want to say four days now, um, I've been going through like a little rough patch and, um, everyone around me has been sensing that there's been something going on with me and, you know, I don't even know what's going on with me to be honest with you. Um, and I'm trying to figure out, you know, myself why I'm feeling this way because I'm normally happy I'm normally, you know, more upbeat, you know, bubbly. Um, and I'm just in this haze, you know, my mind is all cloudy. Um, you know, I can't think straight. Um, you know, one minute I'm sad, the next I'm happy. It's like, what is wrong with me? Like I'm on this emotional roller coaster. And, um, Someone told me that it could be the alignment of the stars um, because, you know, I've been talking to like a few people and they actually have told me that they've been going through the same thing. Um, so I don't know. I went to church today and um, I actually blessed, you know, my amber stone because I do believe, um, you know, in energy in positive energy, because what you put into the world is what you get back. And I really try very hard to not have negative energy around me. And so I feel like maybe I have gravitated some negative energy towards me. Um, so I really wanted to bless my stone today and um, maybe see if that would help, uh, you know, like recharge my stone um, and see if that would help, you know, my mood. Um, but also I wanted to talk to you about something with your soul uh, that goes along with this is that signs. You have to look for signs. Um, and it has been really weird lately, guys. I have to tell you, um, I've been getting a lot of signs, um, good signs. Um, the other day I was looking for something underneath my bed. I think I was looking for a piece of paper, like plain piece of paper because I was going grocery shopping and I came across my journal and something told me to just open up my journal and I did. And this piece of paper came out, folded up, and I opened it, and it actually was a poem of my grandpa's funeral that I wrote uh, for him. And I read it, and I got emotional, and I felt something here. And I think that my grandpa was, you know, uh, actually there um, telling me that everything was going to be okay um, and that whatever I'm feeling will pass, you know, and that this is just, you know, this is, this is, you know, every, this is just a time in my life where I just need to figure things out and that, you know, depression sucks. Yes. Um, everyone has it, you know, it's, it's real struggles, real. 
And, um, you know, and I, I really think that my grandpa came to me um, in that moment. Uh, also, the next day, actually, I opened up my Facebook and right there um, in memories um, was my dog, Tober. Um, he was my first dog and he got hit by a motorcycle when I was on vacation and he died. And wow, <laughs> this is like going to be an emotional, like freaking <laughs> um, uh, YouTube video. <laughs> Shit. Um, and I think that he was, uh, you know, saying to me that everything was going to be okay because I do believe that Tober is my angel because I do see him in the clouds. I know that you guys are probably going to think that I'm crazy and that I need to be in a mental hospital or something. Um, but I do see him in the clouds and actually my parents and my husband and actually my sisters, I actually had taken pictures of him in the clouds. Like you could see shapes of him in the clouds and they actually have seen him too. Um, I believe that he truly is an angel. And this locket right here is of his ashes. Um, so he's always with me. So, yeah. Um, and I, I believe that he was saying, Mommy, everything is going to be okay. Um, and then yesterday at my sister's birthday party, um, I was sitting having my pina colada. And... Out of my, out of the corner of my eye, I saw a cardinal. And a cardinal represents, symbolizes my grandmother. Because my grandmother likes cardinals. And I think my grandmother was telling me that everything was going to be okay. So, um, you know, it, it's kind of like I was getting all these signs in like two days of, you know, Of, a, of my angels telling me that things are going to be okay. And um, I wasn't even looking, you know, for it. It was just coming to me. So I guess what I'm trying to tell you is that there are signs everywhere. You just really need to stop, pause, and breathe and really take time to um, smell the roses. I mean, that saying is really true. And you really need to really pay attention and around you and really observe what's around you. Because honestly, there's signs everywhere. Um, and everything really does happen for a reason. You know, life really does give you messages. Um, you just really have to pay attention. And um, so I just wanted to share that with you guys. And... Um, and I also want to let you guys know that I'm going to be okay. You know, I'm just going through a little tough time and I don't know why I'm sad right now. Um, and I don't know why I feel off. <laughs> um, but you know, I'm strong. I've been through tougher. I've been through worse. So, um, but I love you guys. I hope that I shared some inspiration with you. I hope that you can take something from this. And if you like this video, please give it a like and please subscribe and also click the little bell um, so you can get notifications when the videos that I post go up. And I hope you guys are all having a great Labor Day weekend and cheers to life. Cheers to memories and cheers to what is most important to you guys. I love you guys and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.